It finally looks and feels like winter in New Mexico. Many places in the northern part of the state were blanketed with snow and experienced sub-freezing temperatures. News 13's David Romero joins us live from Santa Fe, where the city is starting to move after a big dose of snow. David. Well, Deanna, we're still a good 14 degrees below freezing at this point, and you can see Surreal's Road behind me, which was a solid sheet of ice, is finally starting to thaw. Now, no matter what the temperature was, crews had to brave the cold and sweep sidewalks and roads throughout the city different. This is how it looked around the plaza around 8 a.m. Most of the roads around Santa Fe had been covered by salt and cinder mix. Still, traffic moved slowly. There were no reports of any major accidents in the area due to the weather other than the minor fender bender. Now we drove up on I-25 and only found one SUV on the side of the road. Surprisingly, many people were actually out enjoying the snow and the cold temperatures. We just kind of take an annual trip. We're from the Bay Area, the San Francisco Bay Area. We just spend a week here every December and we timed it just right because we got this great snowstorm yesterday that we enjoyed. I'm on my way to work and I had the option to drive and I thought, you know, it's such a beautiful morning. I'm just going to put my gloves on and walk to work. And even, even as cold as it is? I love it. It's great. Feels like winter finally. It's been feeling like winter all day and it still does at this hour. Now in total, Santa Fe got about four to six inches of snow out of this storm right here in the city. Deanna, back to you. Okay, thanks, David. Now the largest snowfall amount was 14 inches in the Sangre de Cristo Mountains north of Santa Fe.